Hello everyone, Razorflame Kun here, and in this episode of the Oblivion Let's Play, we are going to be taking care of some things. Uh, first of all, we have some items that need to be sold, and we have some stuff that needs to be deposited back at our base. So I'm going to go ahead and do that stuff right now. So. We're going to go and head to, let's see, four, five, six, seven. Um, we're going to be heading to our mountain tower to deposit several books that we got, including some spell tomes and other and um, skill books and stuff like that. In the last episode, we were lucky enough to find a near-complete set of ebony armor. However, I'm really wanting to get the get the uh, remainder of this set, especially an ebony longsword for sure. I don't really care if I don't get the helm because I'm not going to be keeping this armor set. In fact, um, I can say this with certainty that. Um, I'm only going to be keeping this from now until we are level 20, and that might not be too long. Let's see. Uh, currently, we're able to level up right now, which I didn't know. So I'm going to go ahead and go over here to the master bedroom. Hopefully there's a bed in here. If there, is, if there isn't, I'm going to be pretty upset, but I'm pretty sure that there is a bed in here. If And... Since and if there is, then I'm gonna definitely love um level up, because yeah, there's something that we need to do that I didn't even notice that we needed to do. So we're gonna rest one hour, and yes, we could indeed level up strength, um, willpower. No, not willpower. Speed and endurance. There we go. Um, let's see. Actually. Hmm. I'm going to go luck instead of endurance. There we go. Let's see. How close are we to the next level? No, we're not even close. Um, but uh, heavy armor is getting up there. Alterations getting up there, which is good. Destruction, not so much. Restoration, didn't even think it was going to come even close. But... There's actually, we actually do need, do we need to repair anything? That, it doesn't look like anything needs to be repaired, but there are several, there are a lot of things that we do need to go ahead and take care of right now. I didn't even know that we had this much crap in our inventory. Let's see, how did I organize this? Okay, this is all um, quest stuff. Uh, this is all mods mod related stuff this is, these are okay these are the skill books uh we got one right actually uh, is that one was that one i can't remember if that was one or not um i think it was this and those two are definitely Actually, to be perfectly honest, I do not think this one was. No, I don't think it was. If it was, then I'll put it back in there, but for now, I'm going to keep it out of there. Uh, the, we do have several skill tomes that we do need to go, and we also have a, mod, a book uh, relating to mods that we need to deposit. As for these two other books that we have... I'm thinking about, I don't know, I'm just, I think I'm just going to leave them on the table here. There's not really anything that really needs to be done with them, so I'm just going to leave them both on the table right here. Okay, now that we're, uh, now that we've taken care of that stuff, we have other stuff that we need to take care of, which is depositing the other items that we have. Uh, I believe I set it up mod mod um okay this is this is where the weapons and armor is gonna go that's gonna go in there um 
And I'm going to figure out what I'm going to do with that because I do want to keep that. And I'll, I'll, tell, I'll tell you why in a sec. Uh, let's see. Okay, this is where all that stuff's going. Um, this is all... Um, this this is all ingredients and stuff. Let's just see if we have any that we need to deposit in here. Because of weight or something like that. Yes, we do. We have that and we have that. And we have that. And we have Nurn Roots to deposit. And that's it. Um, so yeah. And then... I think over here was the... Yeah, that's where I'm keeping all that stuff. Sorry if this seems... Uh, if this commentary seems sort of a little... You know... Um, off and on. I'm just sort of debating upon where I'm ke where I'm going to keep stuff. Uh, out, out loud. What I am... What I'm thinking... Oh, what? Ah, I, I could... No, that because that's part. Um, I'm I'm just gonna keep it in one of in one of these chests. This is going to be the chest where I'm gonna keep the set of light armor that I'm gonna be using for getting the light armor skill up. And I actually completely forgot that I still had these. Okay, I can't. Both of these are considered quest items. Okay, they're both considered quest items. So never mind. Should have known since they their weight is zero. Stupid me. But, yep, that's going to be it from here. So now we're just going to press 8. And we're going to teleport out of here. I decided to remove the boots of Jumint uh, because I don't Greetings really need you. them on right now. Uh, what I am going to do, however, it, let's see, does any of these people it's sell spells? Yes, I they do. The finest goods and lowest prices in Holy all syrup. crap. His spells are very high. And price, and I don't have very much money, so I'm not going right. to go ahead and it's, buy any from him. Both the old doesn't have anything. I'm just going to check will. these guys, uh, make sure that they don't have anything, and they don't. Good day. And there's Jaeger. What can I interest you in? Um, 100. Uh, what's his journeyman? Uh, I think I'm just. Okay, this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to go ahead and stop the recording here. When I come back, I'm going to have... Ooh, I'm going to have um, made potions in out of all of the stuff in my inventory and sold it. So, be right back. Alright, I'm back after I've made all the potions. Just, just going around and showing you all the potions that I made. This one was a mistake, and don't know uh, how it happened. And that happens every so often. But just showing, I'm just showing you all the potions that were made. Made. The only potions I'm not selling are going to be these, the light potions. Every other potion I'm going to sell for extra cash. Um, 808 uh, restore fatigue. Don't, um, don't be surprised by high numbers here. That's actually very, very common. Anyways, now to go and sell them. We actually have to go to a different um, location. However, before How I do that... Mixing up some potions? You look like quite the alchemist. What's new with you? I'm going to do a little bit of... On-camera... On-camera ingredient collecting. I'm I'm not gonna do like uh, like what I've shown in the past uh, complete episodes wholly devoted to it, but as you can see, I did a few. Ep Hail, I did citizen. did a little How bit there, and that was on purpose because um, I just wanted to go ahead and uh, make a few more potions before I went ahead and sold them all. I'm Again, don't worry about me selling them on camera. That's not going to happen because it would take too long. Uh, it seems to be raining here. Um, I can tell you right now, I'm not going to be showing them um, me selling them all on camera. In fact, uh, I'm going to cut it right here and I'll be right back. I'm back and the only reason yes? why I came back is because... 
Calendil had some Only spells that I wanted to buy from off of him, so I'm gonna go and buy them off of him. Just these these four right these four spells right here I'm gonna go ahead and buy off of him. Thanks. That's the only reason why I came Goodbye. back. But um now I'm gonna go and sell Good the RL and way, so be right back again. Alright. I'm back and I've sold every single item or every single potion that I made. Uh, as you can see, I, there's still some that ha I haven't. There's still some. Actually, there's one that um no, I don't want to sell that. Come back and see. There's actually one that um be seeing you. One potion that I forgot to make using the scales. So I'm gonna go ahead and make that really quick. Then I'm gonna go ahead. No, put that away and A talk to RL and Way once I more. My wares. I'm sure and there's sell that one potion I just made. That's a good deal. So as you can see, uh, she now has every single potion that I just sold, including, I mean, she has all the potions I just sold, and several other miscellaneous Come items. We now are up to Goodbye. over fifty-one thousand gold, which is what I wanted to do. Also. When I went into RL and wait, she, it turns you out she has a lot of spells that we can buy as well. I'm, I'm going to be buying just the ones that are fairly cheap. Not going to worry about the more expensive ones yet. Just the ones that are below 500, I believe, yeah, below 500. These other ones I'm not going to get right now because okay. it's pointless to get them right now. Um, but that's going to be the theme for the next, I'd say, good deal of time. Is I'm going to be, uh, as I was in the previous uh, few episodes, I'm going to go ahead and try to find more of those air, more places that have them. However, there are a few things that I need to do first. The first thing that I need to do is, let's see... Um, I need to figure out which ones I'm going to... Heavy armor... Okay, heavy armor I can do right here. All I have to do is go to the best defense. And inside the best defense, we talk to um, Varnado. Varnado. What? There's much I can show. Who will allow... Who we can train I'm willing with. To teach you. Knowledge is the I'm going to train with him for all Pay five levels of can. this. I can show you some new things. There we go. For all five levels of this. That costs quite a bit of gold though. Uh already down to forty six thousand. Bye. So as you can see, it's gonna go down pretty quickly, but I wanted to go ahead and make sure that I did that before I did several other things that I want to do. Next on my list of things to do is we are at is to save first because I just did a lot of stuff um, and I'm not sure if I'm a high enough level to do to find ebon more ebony stuff on guys I'm not 100% positive about that so instead I'm going to look up my destruction training spell <laughs> oh, sorry about that but I'm going to sit here and cast this spell on myself a lot of times. So, until my destruction skill increases by 5 levels. Or let's see, actually it's 30 right now. Um, let's see, I'm going to go in ahead and switch over to... Restoration training now. Until I'm going to train my restoration up a level, and then I'm going to train alteration up three levels. I'm go I want to be at least level 17 before I try and find ebony armor on marauders. As previously noted, the only two pieces I need is are a longsword and a helmet. Okay, restoration's increased. So now we go to alteration. To 
four, five, six. Okay, six. That's not the one that I'm looking for. What I'm looking for is open very easy lock. We are going to be casting a spell on uh, this barrel. It doesn't matter what you cast, what you cast it on, as long as it's some sort of door contain or container. See, just casting on a container works. Let's see. So now, just two more. Just need to raise it up two more levels, and I'll be able to do that. However, before I do that, you may be wondering. Well, train the other skills first. Uh, your minor skills, and, that, and I'm I'm going to train the minor skills right now. Um, looks like I'm about to gain a, an acrobatics level, according to this graph. I am, anyways. So I'm just I'm going to just going to jump back and forth here. There we go until I get it, which I just did. Next, um, I'm going to go to my this is some training spell, and we're going to cast this on ourselves quite a lot until we gain a couple levels in this. There's one. I'd say one more level, and then we're going to move on to conjuration. on. As you can see, my magic bar isn't draining at all. Which is the purpose of these training spells, is so that so that you can keep on casting the spell indefinitely without having to use up lots of magicka on them. I'm gonna go one more level in mysticism, which shouldn't take too long. There we go. So I gained three mysticism levels. Uh, illusion next. Five, six, uh, th or three. We're gonna go ahead and start casting the illusion spell several times. And that should help us get up to get up another level. I think I'm only gonna work uh, Mrs. Um, illusion up one, depending upon how fast this goes. Let's see how fast is this going. Oh, it's going pretty fast. I can go up um, one more level, I think. I'll see. Oh, I could probably go up two more levels. But we're all you have to do is just keep on casting spells like this. And that's how you gain this. That's how you gain levels in this really quick. And I'm definitely going to go one more level because I'm almost level 30. Yep, I'm getting there. Next, we're gonna get Conjuration up several levels. Shouldn't take too long, um, especially when Illusion's almost there. There we go, Illusion's up to 30. Now we switch to Conjuration. Again, it's just the um, cast bound arm uh, bound gauntlets on self for one second. So every second, I'm casting the spell and gaining experience. I mean, look at this. I'm already I'm I'm gonna be getting this up several quite a few levels actually. Depending upon how my computer heat is doing, and my computer heat is doing fine, so I'm going to go up to, I think, 42, 43, something like that. Shouldn't take too long to get our, our, ourselves up that high. No, I think I'm just going to go to 40. That seems like a perfect goal for this video. And that's going to be the episode, is just um, training, training these skills. Not a very exciting episode, but one that I had to do because I wanted to be at least level 17 before I went out in search of the ebony longsword and ebony helmets. And there we go, Conjuration's now 40. So next is Alteration again. <coughs> and sorry for the coughs that you've heard several times in the background. I've tried to keep that to a minimum, but like all great things that happens to the best of us and actually 
Uh, when when you're training alteration, it's best to get right up next to the thing that you are using the open, very easy lock on, so that you minimize the time, minimize the amount of time it uh, ca takes to cast, and so that you don't have to wait for the spell to travel the distance between the object that you're casting it to and it hitting it. So this is this. Let me just see. Can I get even closer? Yes, I can. So this way. I'm getting more the most experience out of everything that I did. And there we go. I got the message that I wanted to get, which was that I gained a level and that I should go rest. No, not Silorn. Um, and I should go rest and level up, which is what, exactly what I'm going to do. I'm, I'm, gonna, I, I'm also going to try and rest in different loca locations. So for this rest, I'm going to rest in the Priory of the Nine. So we're going to head into the Priory of the Nine, which is the place we own, and we can sleep in pretty much any bed there. We just go upstairs and over here, and there's a the bed. Sleep, hour. And we're now level 17. Endurance, um, speed, and luck again. No, let's see. Um, willpower. So that's going to be our skill ups. In the next episode of the Oblivion Let's Play, I am going to be going, and we are going to be going in search of. Okay, uh, that's glitched. In search of the ebony, the pieces of ebony armor and other stuff that were missing. So until then, this has been Razor Flame Queen. May all of your days shine brightly.